We got Ozzy through Canines for Kids. And Canines for Kids is an organization that um, is more inexpensive for families. And so we got Ozzy when he was eight weeks old and we had him in the house for like two months uh, before we started any training. And then after that, we went to Washington County um, every week for over a year. And we did uh, tracking and search for Dominic. And then we also did obedience classes or service dog classes. So it was more inexpensive for families. Mm -hmm. And plus the bond that Dominic and Ozzy have is like, they're like best friends. What he does for Dominic is kind of like what he's doing now. If we were to take this off, um, Dominic would just go. And Ozzy kind of like keeps Dominic right here so he has more freedom and he gives me more freedom. I'll show you what happens. Like if you take Dominic away from Ozzy, he goes crazy. So it's like something's going on. I know if Dominic like leaves the house or you know something like that because Ozzy will go crazy go barking. For a boy that can't talk and he can't express himself and, you know, he has a lot of issues, it's nice to know that, you know, Ozzy wakes him up every morning and licks his face and he's always there. So it's, it's nice, that relationship. And like I said, he's had Ozzy since he's been eight weeks old.